So the first thing is take a breath. Uh, courts have recognized that when somebody loses their job that they are entitled to a certain amount of time to figure out what their next steps are going to be. Um, it's obviously a really disruptive time in somebody's life. It can have you know, financial health and other complications. And courts have said people are entitled to a period of time to deal with the blow of the termination. So you know, first thing is just take a step back, catch your breath. After that, it's to start thinking of what your next steps are going to be. And that usually involves consulting various professionals to get advice. Uh, one would be a lawyer, one would be potentially a doctor or somebody else who's providing medical support, and also your financial advisor. It may impact your family's finances, and so you might want to speak to someone right away. The, the biggest thing, though, to do is not sign anything until you've had the benefit of advice. If you go ahead and sign something, a, a severance package or some other contract with the employer, there may be no way that a lawyer or anybody else can undo that for you.